I'm gonna go for a crazy shape now, and I think I'm gonna do three shapes at the same time because I'm just shaking it up on this Tuesday. Which you would think we'd be having tacos, but we're not because we had them last night. Which is strange, I know, but it was Meatless Monday and Taco Tuesday, and we did Meatless Tacos. So to review, venti Starbucks cup, your favorite party cup, solo cup, an iced beverage grande from Starbucks, and a medium hot beverage from Dunkin' Donuts. The neoprene pint glass coolie was great with the venti, not so great with the other ones, mostly because of the height. Oh my god, this is so cute. Not so great for the solo cup. The solo cup was a big hit all around, and as you remember, I want to coordinate these with every outfit. Winning! Wow. It does a super good job on the Starbucks one and on the Dunkin' one. See you later. Reasonable. Get rid of that guy. It's a smidge big on the venti, but really not much. The can sleeve, the most versatile one, fit really well on most of them. Yep, if it's the Dunkin', no problem. Me, not, not so much on the Starbucks, but good on the other two. The neoprene coffee sleeve was fantastic on all of those dials, of course. It's that Starbucks one real nice, and I love how I can just put my hands here and sip it. I mean, how cool would you look with this at a backyard party? <laughs> yeah, it does, and it's so cute. And your standard 12-ounce neoprene can coolie was great. Not an awesome, but it would totally work in a pitch. Want, not working out. I can get it on there for sure, but you can see the sides start to split a little bit, so it's not as great. Water bottle is definitely too tall, so we're not even gonna go ahead. And then same, of course, with this bottle. And I think that's it for styles. Yep. We, got, we of course have Waffle Wednesday. We're having, oh, I forgot the theme name for tonight. I tried quiche for lunch, and the it was a hard pass from the kids. Chicken and rice, so we're working on it. 